We're going to show you some easy and unique sustainable swaps that you can make in your home. Single-use plastics are pervasive, they're everywhere, and we really wanted to participate actively in reducing single-use plastics as well as motivating our community. My sister and I opened the store in December of 2019. The Green Jar is a Toronto refillery where one can bring a container and refill on everyday household products and reduce their household plastic waste. So this is a dish block, basically just a solid bar of dish soap. It replaces three full bottles of dish soap. It sits on top of your counter and you can put it on top of a soap dish or a sponge and you simply take a brush or a sponge and you just dampen your sponge or brush and then make some little circles on top of the soap block. It creates this amazing lather and cleans your dishes really well and so it cuts down on um, the amount of plastic bottles that are coming into your house. These are our favorite vegetable-based counterparts for traditional sponges that are made out of plastic. This one, for example, is made out of vegetable loofah, which is uh, from the cucumber family. And it is extremely durable, so you can use this on your dishes or you can use this um, to clean your bathtub as well as in the shower. And once it's reached its end of life cycle, you can fully compost it and we sell it in this compressed flat version, but when you soak it in water, it becomes really puffy. Depending on like how often you use it, it can last between six months to a year, and you can wash this in the washing machine or the top rack of your dishwasher, and then you would just hang dry it and then use it again. This sponge is another type of um, plastic-free sponge that you can use. It's made out of cotton and corn cellulose fiber and uh, it absorbs quite a bit. It's very durable and it lasts up to 300 washes in your washing machine or in your dishwasher. And uh, it is fully compostable within 28 days once you bury it in your compost or in your garden. It's also really fun to, to use because it expands quite a bit when you add water to it. It really is an easy swap to make, so it's a great way to begin um, swapping something out in your kitchen. This is our reusable coffee filter made out of stainless steel and it fits over any uh, wide mouth jar or mug. We found that you can use regular to medium grounds. Extra fine coffee grounds like espresso can be a little bit challenging. So it is a really low waste way to make coffee and uh, a purchase or an investment in this coffee filter um, means that it lasts you a lifetime. You're not ever going to require paper filters ever again. So we encourage people to use different lids on mason jars. It's a great way to repurpose your mason jar. So uh, we have a couple of favorite ones. So the, the pump is really useful and functional. You can use it for your laundry soap, your dish soap, your hand soap. And um, with the pour cap, you can use this to pour uh, your liquid soap as well as dry goods. You could also use this as um, a drink spout. It seals really well, so you can take it with you and it actually has a little handle, so you can actually carry it with you. These are wool dryer balls that you would put into your dryer. They help to uh, speed up the drying time as well as reduce the static. It also helps to make your clothes feel a little bit softer. So it's like a natural fabric softener. It's uh, a really great sustainable option to the plastic based dryer sheets and you're able to use them for years and years. This is a bamboo toothbrush. The toothbrush is a great way to switch out plastic in your bathroom. 
We use about four toothbrushes a year. And so, for example, in my household, there's about 20 toothbrushes that come through our house in a year. So we really wanted to eliminate that amount of plastic. So you're simply just changing your toothbrush out and it feels exactly the same. And it is uh, like a low stress way to uh, switch out a plastic item in your bathroom. So one effective way to eliminate the waste of toothpaste tubes is to purchase them in tablet form. And these toothpaste tablets are super effective with very basic ingredients and you just pop in one tablet in your mouth and you chew it, it becomes effervescent, you brush your teeth and then you spit it out. It's a great way to uh, travel as well because then you're not carrying liquid and a container this size has about 30 tablets and so if you're brushing twice a day this is good for somebody for about two weeks. Keeping with the dental hygiene theme we wanted to show you another low waste item that you can switch out in the bathroom that's plastic free. So the dental floss that we really love is made out of corn starch and the wax is a candelilla wax. So this would be considered a vegan dental floss and 100% uh, biodegradable and compostable. And the amazing thing about this one is that you can refill your dental floss in the original container. And the packaging for the refill is made out of corn starch as well. So that's also 100% compostable and biodegradable. We really love shampoo bars because we think it's a great alternative to liquid shampoo because it eliminates your plastic bottles in the bathroom. These are specifically designed for the hair, but you can safely use them for the whole body. So this is the perfect package. It's really compact, it's plastic free. Uh, you can travel with it and it lasts upwards of a month. So it's quite an efficient way to save plastic in the bathroom. This is a stainless steel safety razor that replaces your traditional plastic razors. You can safely use a double-edged safety razor on your legs, your face, and armpits, as well as the bikini area. So instead of purchasing a plastic razor that has a plastic body, you're purchasing a metal safety razor, as well as a steel razor blade and it replaces all of this plastic, so you're not throwing that out every few weeks. This is a razor that our mother owned, and this is from 1932. And as you see, the design is almost identical, so it lasts for generations, literally. So then you're only really disposing of the, um, the razor blade, and you can safely recycle those. So these are bamboo and cotton makeup remover pads. You can use this to um, clean your face, you can use it to remove uh, nail polish, and it's a great way to switch out um, a plastic item in your bathroom. Some makeup pads will have a cotton polyester blend, so it's a component that has a small amount of plastic in it. With these, you can hand wash them and hang them to dry, or you can just toss them right into the machine and wash them over and over again and air dry them. So this is just a small selection of many of the products that we have in our shop. We have hundreds of sustainable swaps that we love to share. We are located in Toronto, Canada and folks can purchase our products online as well. We ship across Canada. We managed to do a tally, and in 2021, we managed to divert 45,850 containers from going into landfill by people using our package-free store. I'm excited to see the package-free movement growing, and I feel encouraged that with all our efforts that we will be able to reduce plastics waste. Subscribe to Exploring Alternatives and check out our playlists for more videos like this. You can also follow The Green Jar at thegreenjarshop.com. Thanks for watching.